Hey, what's up? You know who this is. I've been saying this for a very long time. Although I only have 15 subscribers and I'm not getting the recognition I need. I'm going to say this anyway. And I'm going to continue to be honest even though I'm not getting the respect I deserve. Okay. Men of color, in my opinion, you all are cowards. All. I say you all. I didn't say some. I said all. Every time I turn around and I see a strong brother who have worked very hard physically or got his monetary money in order or runs his house or have his own business or whatever he's done, he always back down when it comes to the mental, physical, and spiritual outlook on the female of our race. They get away with criminal activity. They get away with opinions, they get away with laziness, they get away with everything, and no one that claims to be a man are willing to be accountable to put them in a place. And if you do, then you're put down, you're shamed, you're talked about, and you know, they stand away from you. Men of color do not work together. They don't work together and they don't trust each other when it comes to working against the so-called black woman. I found it appalling, insulting, and damn right disgusting that men of color cannot stand up, protect, and tell the truth to females who are acting like they're four-year-olds or younger. You continue to allow yourself to be disrespected by them. You continue to participate in a falsified reality now, let me put it like this. How can men of color sit their dumb asses around and see that every woman with their male counterpart are participating in their culture, but you got a race of women who absolutely disgusted with who you are. They change their natural hair. They support Koreans who are racist against all of us. And let them open up stores in their neighborhood and make the most money and will not support any man or woman of color who will sell the same product. You go to their restaurants, you go to their clothing stores, you do everything. Women have never uh, got away from supporting foreign people in our neighborhood. They're the ones who always do it. From fish fry to hair weave to whatever is bought in the so-called community and overcharged. The so-called black woman will not support the man of color whatsoever to boycott and get rid of anything. But they are on cold. The black woman is on cold. They always work together. They always defend one another. They may not be strong, but they show gather together to talk that shit. And what do men of color do? Nothing. You know, they throw that little shame and shit. Your mama's uh, black, your sister black, your cousin black, your grandmama. Uh, your granddaddy black. Your uh, brother black. Your father black. Your cousin black. Your uncle black. Same shit. But for some reason, when a woman said of color, she has some kind of power to systematically make every man fall to his knee to obey her. Every time there's an incident in the neighborhood where a man of color lose his life, he got some motherfucking female up here representing and talking about how important he was to her. The man don't have shit to say. He just sit there like a little simp and don't say nothing. Men of color, y'all fucked. Okay? I don't have that many subscribers anyway, so I'm just being honest. Y'all fucked and weak. Y'all don't do shit to defend and be a man about shit and, and, and gather your arms together and say, fuck this female who's insulting me. Fuck this female who ain't respecting me. Fuck this female who's putting me down and causing me uh, life brought problems. Fuck her. Instead, you sit your weak ass here and agree with her because you're trying to get some pussy. Why would you do that? Why would you act this way? I've been saying this shit for years. I'm not popular. It's clear on that. But I'm real. And this is why men of color need to get their shit together. 
We need to stop subhumaning ourselves with the females who ain't doing shit for us. They never did shit for us. Ain't giving us shit. Ain't gonna work with us, support us, or anything. You hear a bitch quicker than lightning, t lightning telling you that you need to uh, submit, obey, and pay attention to what we say. And if we even bring up a word submit, obey, or pay attention to what we say, they tune us out. I just got off this bird uh, hair bitch uh, just the other day telling her, I don't want you, I don't need you, and I'm not going to make you do shit. I would never even consider you. If you're not on point and doing what I want you to do, then I don't need you. I'm not going to give you nothing. I'm not going to submit to you. I'm not going to agree with you. I'm not going to give you my opinion because you're not what I want. Until all men start doing this, we're going to continue to fail in the department of getting what we want because we're constantly stumping with these females that ain't got shit for us. And that's real talk.